What's up, it's Hidden here, and welcome back to a new video. So in today's video, it's update day. So there's the new update, and there are a lot of new cool items, not gonna lie. And there's even a golden special one. I'm not gonna tell what it is yet, but inside this chest right here are all the items that are new currently available. There are also new special items that I'm gonna talk about soon, but for now, this is it. So if you look in this chest, you have Toil, Moil, Dirty, Blessed, Refined, and the Builder's Wand itself. Wait. Builder's Wand? Staff go brrrr. So yeah, like you saw, there's a new Builder's Wand. And the Builder's Wand can do so many cool things. Well, not exactly, but if you are a build farmer like me, then this thing is going to be your favorite weapon. So like you just saw right there, yes, you can build whole layers with just this simple wand. I'm so happy they added this to Skyblock. Although this thing is cool and it allows you to build new layers, you cannot place liquid or you cannot make it hold the grass or you cannot make it plant for you. So this is specifically only to build it. You have to do the rest still. The admins aren't that fun. So yeah, that's the first thing we were going to talk about. Let's keep going. Also, the builders want, when you click it, has a inventory. So you can just use this as a personal inventory. Not gonna lie, you can just use the builders want as a simple backpack. It holds two real inventories. So yeah, the builders want can be used to either build something or it can either be used to just use it as a huge backpack. I haven't tested it yet, but can you use swords etc inside it? You can! So yeah, this can just be your backpack. Alright, so the next thing is of course all the new reforges. Now these reforges are actually really useful. So the first thing is toil and this will give you 4% more foraging XP. Moil will give you only 1%. Dirty will give you a new thing called Ferocity. Now, Ferocity is a new thing where you go into your profile, go to your stats, Ferocity. Ferocity grants percent chance to double strike enemies in regiment of 100 increases the base number of strikes. Basically, do you guys remember the old tiger pet? Yeah. This is the new one. So right now you don't have a chance on doing a double hit. Right now you have a percentage. So yeah, if you use this tiger pet with the... Let's say you do a slayer boss and you hit it once. You can double strike it. And this isn't just for the tiger pet. If you, for example, hold a wolf and you're doing wolf slayers. You have a chance to hit him twice. Oh yeah, also Dungeoneers. This is gonna be really good. Thorn. You can destroy him. Apart from that, um, really cool thing to have. The thing that sucks about it though, you don't have really much of it. <laughs> Except if you have a legendary tiger pet, that is. Moving on to the next thing is the Pit Talisman. Now, this one is easily just bought on either the auction house. Or, if you go to the community shop right here, you can also buy the Bits Talisman. Oh yeah, also, the Builders Wand is also in the community center. It goes for 12,000 bits, so it's not really that expensive. And there's also this new book, Compact One. Gain 1% extra mining XP and drop an enchanted block every 400 blocks you mine. Let's just say you are mining gold. And once you mine 400 blocks and the last block is a gold ore, 
you get an enchanted gold ingot. So yeah, I added compact one onto this diamond pickaxe, so we're gonna test this soon. And here's also the bits talisman, which I'm gonna talk about now. Whenever you gain bits, you have a 10% chance of getting double bits of what you usually get. So let's say you get 600 bits. This is just a random number. This is only when you're a senior counselor, but yeah. Let's just say you get 600 bits every single 30 minutes. Then if this 10% happens, you get 1.2 K. Don't get too excited though. It's a one in 10% chance. And also it's just a really cool talisman. So now you can just recombobulate it and get some free boost. Now that we went on to every single item, I am going to show you the new thing. However, also there is blessed, which will increase the chance for double crops by 5%. And there's also you gain more and more farming XP. Now, what else gives you double crop chance? Yep, you basically get a free level let's say 25 legendary elephant on your hoe oh yeah also not to mention you get free speed what else could you want then there's also refined which will give you two plus mining xp and there's also gaining a 0.1 percent chance to drop a enchanted block for the ores that you mine same story you can get an enchanted gold ingot, however the chances are not really that high. So yeah, that's all the new reforged stones. Now I'm going to show you the location where to get them. Did I just get the double 10% chance a second ago? Boy, I'm lucky. Okay, so if you go right next to the community center, right here, which is the blacksmith, you can see there's a door opening right here with a name sticking out. Now if you go in there, you see another beautiful jetty. And when you talk to him, he will sell you the Reforge Anvil, the Moyo Log, the Dirty Bottle, the Toil Log, the Refined Amber, and the Blessed Fruit. So here's where you can buy them, and here's what it does. I showed every single one of them. I just realized while I was editing the video, I didn't even do the compact thing. So let's just do that right now. One, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 40, 99. And once I mine this ore. What? what? It only is at 39? I might... What a scam. Wait, what? Why does it only count coal? That doesn't make any sense. Okay then. Does it count lapis? No. Only counts if you mine coal blocks. Okay then, uh, 96, 97, 98, 99, and once I mine this block, boom, compact two. Wait, does cobblestone count? Lol, this is not even hard at all. Oh yeah, got an enchanted cobble. Neat. And now onto the main part, which is the new mayor, Scorpius. So if you stalk the Scorpius right here, it says a little donation. This is how long you have been playing Hypixel Skyblock. And you can collect it if you actually voted for him. Now, the second thing he has, 
is interesting. Darker auctions. Scorpius will intrude in dark auctions, increasing the amount of rounds to 7. Usually in the dark auction there are only 3 to 4 items and then the dark auction ends. Now with Scorpius, there are 7 items and the dark auction ends. And that's not just all. And offering special items. Now the offering special items thing is unique. If you go to the auction house, you will see when you go to enchanted books, at the current time playing, there is nothing new. Because there was a glitch and the dark auction didn't give any of the new items. I will probably try to go in in 30 minutes or 40. But yeah, for now, I can only show you screenshots. But before we go on to the new books, let me show you something you can look at. Now, if you go to recipe book and you go to the Slayer recipes, go to the next page. Oh, what is this little ball? That's right, the plasma flux. Remember those overflux tryhards trying to flex? Well, now it's plasma flux tryhards. So the plasma flux, apart from the overflux, has unique abilities. It has the same stuff, however it increases it. Now that you've seen the new flex of Hypixel Skyblock, let's go on to the new enchanted books. So the first new thing is called Counter-Strike. Counter-Strike grants you a certain amount of defense for a certain amount of seconds depending on the level of the book on the first hit from an enemy. So let's say you are doing a livid boss, then if the livid hits you once, you gain defense. And yeah, I don't know if Hypixel is trying to get copyright striked or not, but... Uh... And then there's also the uh, funny thing, <laughs> Big Brain. This is not a joke. Big Brain grants you a certain amount of intelligence. However, this is an enchanted book bundle. We don't really know what this does yet. However, if you right click to open it, it grants you five enchanted books. Probably all being the Big Brain 3 book. Then there's also Vicious Tree. It grants you 3% of ferocity and also is a bundle, so if you right click it, you get 5 books of Vicious Tree. Apart from that, there's also a new artifact in the game called Hegemony Artifact. It doubles the stats of the Reforge on this item. So that means if my Bit Talisman gives me 7 HP and 2 Intelligence, the artifact would give me 14 HP and 4 intelligence. And then there's the final item. The biggest flex has returned. Remember the Midas sword? 50 mil Midas? Yeah. This is the Midas staff. The Midas Staff gives you 130 damage, 150 strength, and it gives you 50 intelligence. The item ability is Molten Wave. Cast a wave of molten gold in the direction you are facing. Deals up to a certain amount of damage. Now, this is basically the mage weapon for the Midas Sword. The item damage bonus of this item is dependent on the price paid for it at the dark auction. The maximum bonus of this item is 16,000 if the bid was 100 million coins or higher. Yeah, unless you're a Hypixel Skyblock Sweat, good luck getting that thing. 50 mil Midas was already a little pain. Good luck on the staff. And yeah, that's everything inside the new Hypixel Skyblock update. There's also the new builder's house, but this one isn't really interesting apart from this guy right here. The redstone engineer. He sells you a lot of redstone items, so I'm pretty sure that redstone could be activated someday. 
And yeah, that's all for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If this helped you, please leave a like, subscribe if you're new. I'm gonna do a lot more of these videos, challenges, anything you want me to do. Just leave it in the comments below if you have 